We know that there are about 380,000 different species of green plants and we get over half our calories from just three of those species. So you might think the fact that one in five of those species of plants are threatened with extinction doesn't really matter. Maybe we lose a few. Does it really make a difference? Well, the difference it makes is to the diversity of life on the planet. And diversity means resilience. The more different kinds of plants there are, the greater chance there is that something will be able to adapt to and survive the changes that either the planet or we throw at them. To have any hope of conserving plant diversity, it's necessary to know exactly what's growing where. Using satellite imagery and geographic information systems, Kew scientists are able to produce vegetation maps of almost any part of the world. One such project was the production of the vegetation atlas of Madagascar. This work was undertaken by Q and a number of different international partners. One of those was um, a Malagasy who, who came over to learn geographical information system techniques in the, the unit at Q. Q works in partnership around the world to discover and conserve plant diversity. Q scientists are working with partners in Peru to conserve and reinstate the Hirango tree. The Hirango project shows that sometimes the key to saving an entire habitat starts with just one species. El clima ha cambiado por falta de los guarangos y las especies nativas que conjugaban junto con el guarango han desaparecido en gran parte. Eso está permitiendo que vengan enfermedades, el desierto esté avanzando. Through this project, Q has been collecting and propagating these important species of the southern forest of Peru. And uh, this wouldn't have been possible without the help of hundreds of, uh, um, of people uh, that they live in the area. Uh, in fact, for us, uh, uh, this project, uh, um, we, we are carrying out this project to conserve biodiversity, but in their case, uh, it's uh, uh, to protect their home. Esto era un campo vacío, desolado, pero gracias a Q, hoy es un jardín bonito que se está propagando miles de plantas. Vamos trabajando ya hace varios años para propagar las especies nativas de nuestra tierra, de nuestra zona, mejorando el ecosistema también y creando microclimas en las zonas donde ya se había extinguido. Eso es importante sí, sí, para sí. todos nosotros. This is uh, um, the Millennium Seed Bank, a Waco's place. Uh, here we are conserving at minus 20 seed collection from all over the world and we are working with around 120 uh, collaboration worldwide. These seeds uh, in reality are, um, uh, are uh, alive uh, um, they will be in the future when some species will disappear from uh, some part of the world where we have been uh, collecting them, we will be able to germinate them and also to grow the plants and put them back uh, in their wild environment. One in five of the world's plants is now threatened with extinction. Working with their global partners, Q has shown that there is no technical reason why any of these plants should disappear forever.